interesting. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing the Harry Potter tag part 2. I'll have the link down below to the part 1 if you're interested in and let's get started. So the first question that is number 16 because we finished at the 15 last time is which is your favorite Death Eater? Draco Malfoy, because he's so underrated. Everyone sees Harry's perspective and he really had no choice and I feel so sad and sorry for him. Next question is, if you could have a Deathly Hollow, which one would you take? Um, I think the Invisibility Cloak because the other one is so much power and I don't think that I need it. The Resurrection Stone, definitely not, because it's so against nature and I am full, let the things flow and so, yeah, the Invisibility Cloak. Next question is, which is your favorite quote? If I have to pick one, it will be not from the Harry Potter movie, but directly from J.K. Rowling. And it's, it's important to remember that we all have magic inside us. Because it's such a powerful quote, and it means that as you have magic inside you, that other people have too. And this makes all of us so special. Then, who would you like to survive? Who would you let die? I would like to survive Fred Weasley because I cannot imagine George's life after that. So J.K. Rowling, you killed part of my heart. And I will let die Voldemort over and over again. Question number 20. What will be your Patronus? I definitely should have to retake the quiz at this point because I made it so many times ago. And I think that last time I took a cat. 21. Did you expect a different ending? If yes, how you imagined it? I have not expected a different ending, I just not expect anything to not be disappointed and I loved the ending. Neville that kills Nagini is so amazing, Harry that jump off the arms of Hagrid and the story of Helena, Ryan Claw is so amazing and I loved the end. 22 is what you will choose between a hole, a cat and a frog. A cat, even if I am allergic, I don't like the smell of a hole, especially when it's in the cage with the holy stuff. And the frog, since relative, doesn't excite me, so the cat. 23 is in which house you would like to go. Ravenclaw, no doubt about it. I was sorted in Ravenclaw when I was a child. I grew up in Ravenclaw, I retake the quiz and I was in Ravenclaw. And each time that I retake the quiz, each time I'm in Ravenclaw. So, and of course, please let me know in the comments down below in which house are you in. In which one would you not go? Slytherin, and not because I have something against Slytherin, it's just that its common room scares me. I love the light so much and I feel that Slytherin common room is too dark to me. But I love Slytherin. 25 is which position would you play in a Quidditch match? The supporter, because I am not good at all in sport. 26, what do you think of the people who said Harry Potter is just a book? Nothing, each one has his own opinion and it's right. Probably I could not understand someone else passion so which is your favorite fantastic creature nifflers they're so cute and the baby nifflers in the crimes of grindelwald are the cutest creatures ever 28 is which is your favorite couple in the saga mr and mrs weasley with nothing they built the most loyal and amazing family they teach me that there are things so much more important than money malfoys they have lots of money and lots of things and basically they live into the dark and weasley are completely the opposite and the weasley family in general teach me to focus on the things that you that you have and not to focus on the things that you don't have and just be happy for have a precious family. 29 is, and your last favorite, Ron and Lavander, because it's too much sugar for nothing, in my opinion, and I support Ron and Hermione. So. And 30 
if you could talk with JK Rowling, what you will say? Probably it will be by crying. <laughs> Just thank her for give to me and to so many people a magical childhood and a magical world when you always can feel at home. So guys, this was all for today. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will see you here soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.